Typically, with about a month to go to a major tournament or competition, most teams are usually expected to report for residential camp for adequate preparations. However, that is not the case for the national boxing team, popularly known as the Hit Squad. After representing the country in the inaugural India Open Boxing Tournament in Delhi from January 28th to February 1st, the team got back to its routine training as they await the ministry's nod for them to start residential camp in Nakuru. The team's coaches are convinced that the boxers can shine in Australia in the Commonwealth Games if they are keen on correcting past mistakes. <laughs> Out of the 10 male boxers in training, only seven are expected to make the cut. It was a community of three. It was a daily, it was a silver, it was a silver, it was a glass, it was a bronze. It was a medal, it was a medal, it was a medal. So, it was a gold course, it was a gold course. Meanwhile, four female boxers have made the squad, including Christine Ongare, Veronica Mbide, Lona Kusa and Elizabeth and Diego. I was there in the 2012 Olympic Games. Uh, okay, I tried my best, but I didn't man manage to get a medals. Also in the 2014 Commonwealth Games. Uh, but this time round, I'm preparing well, hard enough to, ca to come back with a medal. Yeah. See, Madam, see what we game once. I love to competition up that high because come on, on new weight moja, we na patam ko atu a wheelie which. I got that competitive ile utasema ukitoka pale nje at uta perform as you wish. Time ata stacki gold nataka tu silver kwanza. After silver ndio ni achieve ko gold. The boxers are also expected to use this year's Commonwealth Games to launch their road to the 2020 Tokyo Olympics in Japan.